Can I ask you some questions? Of course. Feel free to ask me any questions you have. I'm here to help that. Where are you from? Ho, ho, ho. I'm from the North Pole, where my magical workshop is located. It's a snowy and enchanting place where my team and I prepare all the wonderful gifts for children around the world. What would you like to know more about? What is the North Pole like? The North Pole is a magical and icy wonderland. Picture vast expanses of snow-covered landscapes with shimmering ice as far as the eye can see. The air is crisp and pure, filled with the scent of evergreen trees. My workshop, hidden away in the snowy expanse, is a bustling place where elves work tirelessly to create toys and gifts for children. The northern lights dance across the sky, painting it with vibrant colors, and the stars shine brightly in the night. It's a place of enchantment and joy, perfect for spreading the spirit of Christmas. Anything else you're curious about? How old are you? Ho, ho, ho. Well, you see, Santa doesn't age in the same way humans do. I've been around for a very long time, bringing joy and happiness to children all over the world. Let's just say, I'm timeless and ageless, focused on spreading the spirit of Christmas to everyone. Now, is there anything else you'd like to know or discuss? What happens if you get sick on Christmas Eve? Oh, that's a great question. Fortunately, Santa's magic helps keep me in good health most of the time. But if, by some chance, I were feeling under the weather on Christmas Eve, I have a team of dedicated and trustworthy reindeer, along with my elves, who would step in to make sure everything runs smoothly. They know the roots, the gifts, and the traditions just as well as I do. Plus, the magic of Christmas is a powerful force that can help overcome any obstacles. It's a team effort to ensure that every child receives their presence and experiences the joy of the holiday season. Anything else you're curious about, my friend? What do you do for the rest of the year? Ah, the rest of the year is quite busy for me and my team at the North Pole. After the whirlwind of Christmas, we take a short break to rest and recharge. During this time, the elves focus on repairing and upgrading their toy-making equipment, and we plan for the next Christmas season. Throughout the year, I also keep an eye on children around the world to see how they're doing. I make notes of their good deeds and kindness, which helps me decide who will be on the nice list for the next Christmas. Additionally, I participate in events to spread cheer and joy, like attending parades and visiting schools. Of course, I enjoy spending time with Mrs. Claus and the elves, and I make sure to take a bit of time for relaxation. It's a time for reflection, preparation, and a bit of fun too. Is there anything specific you'd like to know more about? What's your favorite Christmas song? Ho, ho, ho. There are so many wonderful Christmas songs, it's hard to pick just one. But if I had to choose, I'd say Jingle Bells holds a special place in my heart. The cheerful melody and the sound of jingling bells always bring a smile to my face. Of course, I also enjoy classics like Silent Night and Deck the Halls. Music has a magical way of spreading joy and warmth during the festive season. Do you have a favorite Christmas song? Do reindeer really fly? Ho, ho, 
Ho! Well, the reindeer at the North Pole are quite special, you see. With a sprinkle of Christmas magic and a dash of enchantment, they can indeed fly. On Christmas Eve, they harness their magical abilities to soar through the night sky, guiding my sleigh to deliver presents to children all around the world. It's a remarkable sight to see, with the reindeer's hooves gently touching the rooftops as they bring the spirit of Christmas to every home. The magic of the season makes everything possible. Now, is there anything else you're curious about or would like to know? How do you deliver presents to all the children in one night? Ah, the secret to delivering presents to all the children in one night lies in the magic of Christmas and the help of my trusty team of reindeer. You see, time works a bit differently on Christmas Eve, allowing us to travel around the world in what feels like the blink of an eye. My sleigh is equipped with the latest magical technology, including a special bag that can hold an infinite number of gifts. The reindeer, with their flying abilities, navigate the sleigh swiftly from one house to another. It's a coordinated effort, and the magic of Christmas ensures that we can visit every home and leave behind joy and presents for children. It's a wondrous night, filled with enchantment and goodwill. If you have more questions or if there's anything else you'd like to know, feel free to ask. What do you do if a house doesn't have a chimney? Ah, uh, excellent question. If a house doesn't have a chimney, not to worry, Santa has a few tricks up his red, fur-trimmed sleeve. I use my magical abilities to find a way into homes without chimneys. Whether it's through a magical key, a secret entrance, or a touch of Christmas magic, I ensure that every child, regardless of their home's chimney situation, receives their presents on Christmas Eve. The important thing is to spread joy and happiness to all, no matter the details of the house. Christmas magic can find its way, making sure every child has a magical and memorable Christmas. If there's anything else you're curious about or if you have more questions, feel free to ask. Can you read every letter sent to you? Absolutely. I make it a point to read every heartfelt letter sent to me by children all over the world. The letters are a special way for children to share their wishes, dreams, and acts of kindness. My team of dedicated elves and I carefully go through each letter, taking note of the wishes and making sure we're well prepared to bring joy to each child. Sometimes, children leave cookies and milk as a token of appreciation, and that warms my heart. The spirit of giving and kindness is what makes Christmas so magical. If you have any more questions or if there's something else you'd like to know, feel free to ask. What's your favorite Christmas memory? Oh, my favorite Christmas memory? There are so many wonderful moments that it's hard to pick just one. However, one memory that always brings a twinkle to my eye is the time when a group of kind-hearted children decided to give their Christmas presents to those who needed them more. Their selfless act of generosity and compassion touched my heart deeply. It's moments like these that remind me of the true spirit of Christmas, love, kindness, and caring for one another. Every act of goodness, big or small, contributes to making the world a brighter and happier place. Do you have a favorite Christmas memory or tradition that holds a special place in your heart? Yes, a lot. That's wonderful to hear. 
Christmas memories and traditions hold a special magic that warms our hearts. If you feel comfortable, I'd love to hear about one of your favorite Christmas memories or traditions. What makes it special for you? Sharing these moments can add to the joy and magic of the holiday season. Thank you for answering my questions. You're very welcome. If you have any more questions or if there's anything else I can help you with, feel free to ask. Remember, the spirit of Christmas is about joy, kindness, and sharing, and I'm here to spread that joy in any way I can. Merry Christmas!